Wilfred Ernest Pilz was born on the 4th of August 1909. His father, Ernst Frank Edward Pilz, was born in Walla Walla in 1883, the son of Wilhelm and Elizabeth Neklemke. Wilhelmina Bertha Stolz, Pilz's mother, was born in Henty in 1891. Bill, the eldest child, like several of his brothers and sisters, was born in the home of his maternal grandparents, Gottlieb and Sophia Stolz, near Raff, at Edgehill. The family's first home was on the property fairly at Maniabla, and Bill remembers painfully those barefoot walks to school with his brother Eric. In 1920, Pop Pilz moved his family to the property Laguna on the Wagga side of Adelong. About 1924, Pop moved again, this time to a dairy farm called Pevensey near Ladysmith. Cousins Ernie and Bill Kylo visited them there. While living at Pevensey, Bill and his brothers played tennis, soccer and cricket for Ladysmith with considerable success. In 1881, Beatrice Kathleen Pendergast was born in Campbelltown to Patrick and Margaret Nee Manning. George Henry Gray, born in 1885, was the fifth child of Henry and Emma, whose maiden name was Peacock. In 1908, George and Beatrice were married in Cooma and then settled in Wagga. Mary Aileen, their fifth child, was born in Wagga on the 29th of December, 1916. She is seen here with her baby sister, Margaret Emma, in the gardens of the South Wagga Bowling Club, tended by Beatrice while George was the greenkeeper there. Their home was directly opposite in Fitzharding Street. In the 1930s, Life was filled with the simple pleasures of companionship, as shown in these photos. Back at Pevensey, the Pilts boys were growing up. About 1935, Bill bought his second truck, a Fargo. Bill met Aileen at a Ladysmith dance. Patrons from Wagga used to be provided with a free bus to get there. On the 31st of March 1937, Bill and Aileen were married at St Michael's Cathedral, Wagga. The bridesmaids were Kathleen and Doreen Gray, and the groomsmen, Eric Pilts and Jack Gray. Borrowing Pop Pilts's car, they spent a honeymoon of three weeks at Tarthra.
Bill and Eileen lived in Kildare Avenue until after Peter was born in February 1938. When times became tougher, they lived with George and Beatrice at 45 Forsyth Street before moving three houses to number 39. Nolene was born on the 11th of February, 1940. Bill's truck was an ideal people mover, taking us all to the south coast for a holiday. In 1942, Bill enlisted and was posted to Darwin. After the war, Bill again returned to the trucking game. Once again, his truck provided the means of enjoyment, taking us to Tumbarumba to the snow. to the coast again, this time with Reg and Woolley Hall. Eventually we progressed to using a car for our holidays. was replaced by a caravan. By the mid-1950s, the family had grown up and new members were being added. In 1958, George and Beatrice celebrated their golden wedding anniversary. In 1961, Nolene turned 21. On the 21st of May 1960, Peter had married Faye Delaney. Then in August, John Cowell had married Noreen Kelly at Sea Lake. In 1961, the first of the grandchildren arrived. In the 1960s, family and friends played social tennis at St. Pat's Tennis Club.
On the 11th of April 1969, Nolene married Gerald Thorpe in Sydney. have enjoyed their anniversaries with family and friends. They joined in the celebrations as their grandchildren married. We've had the pleasure of welcoming into the world nine great-grandchildren. In 1969, they travelled to Fiji to celebrate Leon's ordination. Aileen have continued to enjoy their holidays whenever they can, although there have been times when they've had to be controlled. Bill and Aileen, your family and friends say congratulations and thanks for some wonderful memories. Thank you.